Well, for instance, the fact that I could take this cheese knife and stick it in your eye, and the university would still have to pay me. I'd be in jail, but I'd still be paid. Are you seriously thinking of doing that? No. You hesitated. Yes. Papa, did you ask when she'd be back? Yes. A second ago, you assumed. Asked, assumed, same thing. Not at all the same thing. Pretty close. You teach at Columbia. They should be terrified. How did you get in here? I came through the other door. Just because there is a door does not mean you use it. A door does not represent infinite possibilities. Excuse me, Ethan. It is now after dinner. After dinner is my time to read. Therefore, I need the room. And you are not starving. I am too. Then your muscle and tissue would be breaking down. Your abdomen would be distended. Your menstruation would cease. Hey, stop. What is that? She said she was literally starving. I'm at your service, Mr. Weissman. Your hand is wet. Hey, don't. Don't you make it get hotter. What is wrong with you? Your son is not who you think he is. He is a high level. I don't know what he is. Noah? If that's his name. Of course that's his name. What makes you so sure? We named him. Well. Hi, Abe. Very good. Deducing that I am Abe Miriam's father. Hello, person I've never met before. Nice to see you for the very first time. Could you excuse me a minute? I need to use the bathroom. Oh? That's something you do? Yes. You don't talk to me or look at me. If you see me on the street, you will cross the street, whether or not there is a crosswalk present. Your pedestrian safety is of no importance to me. You can go in your father's closet. What? What's going in my closet? Nothing! This door won't move. There are things in front of it. Why? Am I supposed to live in here now? Was that grapefruit the last breakfast I'm ever going to eat? To be truly effective, you must be ugly. No! No what? No, I forbid it. You forbid me to get back together with my husband? Yes, I forbid it. You have laid waste to everyone and everything around you. It's been like a typhoon. The Red Cross should start handing out blankets. You have ruined everybody's life. Life isn't fair. It's hard and cruel. You have to pick your friends as if there's a war going on. You want a husband who'll take a bullet for you. Not one who points to the attic and says, they're up there. Hello. Two meters. Yeah, from Two where? Horns, okay. The village, what? I'll take care of the hawk. I can't hear you. I live in a lunatic asylum. I don't know why you won't come stay with us. It's the answer to all your problems. You live in a one bedroom in Poughkeepsie. And that beard is a fire hazard. Mom, he told us to butt out. Really, Mama, could you back away from the phone just a smidge when you talk? She says you should back off. What do I say? I think you should just go in there and be sweet. She's probably homesick by now. She's probably just waiting for you to sweep her off her feet and carry her back to the Upper West Side. Oh, that's gonna be murder on my back. Now, if you'll excuse me, my dinner time is six o'clock. Only gangsters eat at nine o'clock after some bootlegging and a hot game of craps. You say pas, vous savez pas compter, vous pouvez pas compter là. What, 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 what did he say? I don't know, I don't speak French. What do you mean you don't speak French? I mean, I don't speak French. All this time with your mother, she never taught you French. No. That's the only reason I asked you to come. I'll admit that sometimes I tune people out, but mostly because they rarely have anything useful or interesting to say. What can you make that's French? Nothing. What can you make that we can say is French isn't, but he'll never know? Goulash. Perfect. I still control this house. I'm just doing it from in there. I want you to talk to Miriam. About what? Her son eats with his mouth open. It needs to stop. Shirley's coming in. She might be naked. She walks around the house naked. We gotta go. I'm here to see you. Wait, you didn't wire her? No, why? Papa, we had a whole conversation where I told you to let her know we were coming. We did? Yes. I have no memory of that. Because we had nothing. Every day was Yom Kippur. Moish, please, I'm atoning for the things I'd like to do to that man. Nice try, sweetheart. Let it out. Miriam, I have to go. I just heard the words potato salad. There's only so much a man can take in his own house. The scraps we do have left. Oh my God. Professor Weissman? You're right. Give him air, guys. Yeah, he just saw a naked man. I'm okay. We should go. Put the egg rolls in your purse. My purse is silk. Fine. Anyone with pockets, grab a roll. Everyone gets a gift. Everyone gets a compliment. Everyone gets a hug. You're not preparing these kids for the real world. I love him. God damn it! God damn it! God damn it! I'm fine. Boy.
And I thought your teenage years were a problem. <laughs>